Hey everybody, this is a fishing trip on October 25th. We have north winds here, overcast conditions, and an outgoing tide. Uh, I don't really like north winds. I don't usually do too well with them compared to other winds. Uh, but uh, it wasn't that bad, and it was supposed to get better through the evening. Started off fishing for black drum and sheep's head around the inlet, uh, but the outgoing tide and fishing solo on my boat wasn't really an option, so I really couldn't continue it catch one little sea bass here and then realize you know I'm just gonna lose tackle and everything and uh, it's time to move on so I went to the Route 50 bridge and anchored which is a little bit different tactic for me water's still a warm 67 degrees uh, so that was really great it's been very slow to cool down this year so far I uh, used shiners just used a 4-0 hook uh, one ounce weight on the bottom and uh, thawed them out hooked them up and uh, threw them out. Now on this you're going to see some fan casting. So I'm going to just kind of systematically go around and try to find spots where there may be flounder in different depths. So uh, you'll see that. You'll see the rod get tapped here on the flounder and then later the striper, which is really cool. Enjoy. bit short. Yep. Short bite. Caught the back of the bait. Didn't catch the, uh, didn't catch up on the hook side of it. You can feel it. Pull it off. At least something's biting. This north wind's always been very unfriendly to me, so I'll take a little action, that's for sure, and be thankful. <laughs> Go right back to him. See if he, uh, Let's play again. Maybe he'll bite him better. Hmm. Interesting. Let's go out a little further. Oh man. <laughs> Test my knots out. I love it when the sun comes through this bridge like this. It's dinner time. I love it when that sun comes through. Seems like they get a little more active. 